There was one columnist today who was talking about the possibility the president should go ahead and, and call their bluff. Go ahead and impeach me now, do, do it now, but get it done fast. What do you think? Yeah, and it's definitely hitting the headlines and it's really grabbing a lot of people's attention. But what I find really interesting is, you mentioned this earlier, when you look at the markets, they are pricing in the information they have and they're efficient enough to market those risks that they think are plausible. They're not seeing impeachment as a viable risk when it comes to their markets. And it's quite literally people putting their money where their mouth is and they're just not really worried about this as a viable risk. And do you I think, think that's they are worried about some of the other signs that don't look altogether stable? on the part of the president, the way he handled the Turkey thing, where even those in his own party said, whoa, 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 this is awful. And, and the G7 thing, which to Jessica's point came and went, but it did raise questions. Are, are you thinking things through, even among Republicans? Yeah. You're going to get that, and I think there have been some conflicting news of how, how are people feeling about this, but at the end of the day, when you actually look at the data that's coming out, like all the earnings reports, the right. jobs reports, all of the consistent data that affects everyone's day-to-day -day lives continues to be strong, and I think that's really what people are focusing more on. Wall Street is a very interesting crowd, and I remember as the, Bill, mm -hmm. you know, the whole Clinton thing. Um, they love the Clinton. They love the ride with the, for the economy. They love the boom in the market. These guys are not red or blue. I said it many, many times. They're green. They love money, money, money. And they like to make it hand over fist. They did with him. They've been doing it with Donald yeah. Trump. I think that's one thing that is, is, is a very positive backwind for the president. I have to agree with that. And I, that's where I think, historically speaking, there isn't a lot of data to show that the market should be worried about an impeachment. Right. We saw with Nixon, the S&P 500 was down about 13 percent throughout his and impeachment And he had a lot process. of bad stuff going on. That's true. Time. Stagflation, <laughs> oil crises, the rest. I was sure. too young, but you were <laughs>